Hey guys, my name is Krishna. I'm a second degree black belt from Soma's Fit. Today I'm going to be teaching you some basic white belt level techniques. I'll be teaching you three techniques today. Two of them are going to be hand techniques and one's going to be a leg technique. The two hand techniques are a down block and a punch. The leg technique is going to be a front snap kick. So you can do the hand techniques and leg techniques in a combination. So it'll look like this. Down block, kick, punch. You can do them in other stances as well. So you can do it in a horse stance. So it's down block, kick, punch. Before we start doing techniques, we first have to warm up and stretch. So follow along with me. One, two, three, four. 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 One, two, three. Four. One, two, three, 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 four. So now, now we have to start warming up. All right, so for warm-ups, we're going to do four. First, we're going to hop for eight counts. Okay, follow along. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Next, jumping jacks for eight counts again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Next, knee highs for eight counts. One, two, five, six, seven, eight. Next, finally, we're going to do toe hitting for eight counts again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, now that we're warmed up, we can start doing techniques. OK, let's start with punches. But before we start punching, we have to learn how to make a fist. So I, wanted, I want you to take your uh, open hand like this and curl your first, first four fingers like this. Then take your thumb and then put it on top of your curled fingers. Make sure you, put, make sure you don't put your thumb on top, in, uh, on the side, or inside your curled fingers. That way, when you punch, you keep your thumb safe. You also want to make sure that your wrist is in line with your first two knuckles, so like this. Make sure your, thumb isn't, your hand isn't like this, like this, or like this, or like this. So when we start punching, we want to make sure we keep our hands on our waistline. And we punch to the solar plexus here. So it should be out in front of you, like this. So now you start by bringing your hand that's on your waist out to the hand that's outside. So it should be like this, one, two, three, four. Then again, one, two, three, four. As you do this, you want to make sure that your other hand twists as well. So it shouldn't be like this. It should be like this, one, two, three, four. OK, from the side view, it looks like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So now if we speed it up, it'll look like this. One, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. OK, so now let's do blocks. So what you want to do is you want to take your right hand and keep it out in front of you like this. I'll show you from the side view first. So then take your left hand and then keep it up by your shoulder, so here. And then what you want to do is you want to take your left hand and bring it down to where your right hand is and bring your right hand back at the same time. So it'll look like this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. At five, you should make sure that you snap this hand out and bring this one back. So same for the other hand. It'll be like this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So faster to look like this. One, two, three, four. 
Okay, so when we start kicking, what we want to do is first we want to take our right leg and keep it behind us. So it'll be like this. So first, to warm up our kicking muscles, what we're going to do is we're going to take our right leg and do a leg raise. So it'll be like this. Just lift it straight to your waist height. Do that another two times. So one, two, three. Now switch which leg is behind you. So now bring your left leg back and do the same thing again. So it'll be one, two, three. Go back to having your right leg behind. And now bring your knee up. So it'll come up to like here, again at your waist height. Later, you can bring it higher to get a higher kick. So it'll be like this. One, two, three. Same for the other leg. One, two, three. Notice that when we do this, we keep our hands up the whole time. We don't want to drop them down and do this. One, OK? So keep them up. It should be like this. One. Now, the next step is to make sure when you do this, you release the knee. So it'll be out. It's like this. One, two. One, two. One, two. Same for the other leg. One, two. One, two. One, two. Now I'll show you this from the side view. So it'll be like this. One, two. One, two. Same for the other leg. One, two. One, two. So if I show you the front kick at full speed in one motion, it'll look like this. One, two. Same from the side view. One, two. All right. OK, so now that we've learned how to do all the techniques individually, let's add some footwork and movement. OK, so what we want to do first is let's take our left leg forward and punch with the same arm. So it'll be one, and then step forward again with right leg and right hand. Two, and then left. Three. Again, it's one, two, three. Now for blocks. It'll be the same left leg, left hand thing again. So one, two, three. Again, one, two, three. Now for kicks. Keep your, arm, keep your hands up, and then this time with your right leg. So whatever leg's behind you kick with. So it'll be one, two, three. And again, one, two, three. OK, so now that we've learned all of the kicking and hand techniques on their own with movement, we can combine them to make a combination. So it'll look like this. Take your left leg back and step forward with your le left leg and block with your left hand. So it'll be like this. Low block. Now step forward with your right leg and kick with your right leg. Kick and then punch with your right hand again. Punch. So now, if we, now we can go again from here. And we'll keep going forward three times. So it'll be down block, kick punch. Then take, this, uh, take your hand that's out and then do a down block. Down block, kick, punch. So you always want to strike or block with the, hand that's already, with the leg and hand that's already out. So it'll be down block, kick, punch, and one more time. Down block, kick, punch. OK, so this was my first video. I taught you guys some basic white belt level techniques. If you want to see more like this, stay subscribed, and I'll be posting things like this in the future. Thank you.